Quick Tech Tip Pressure Gauges and Pumping Systems by the John Brock Company There are two basic types of gauges found in pumping systems, pressure gauges and compound gauges, which measures both vacuum and pressure. All gauges indicate the difference in pressure between the port and the outside environment. As an example, if we have a pressure gauge installed in a pipe that reads 30 psi and the environmental pressure is 13 psi absolute, then the absolute pressure in the pipe would be 43 psi. Note, zero absolute pressure is a perfect vacuum. Now, if there is a compound gauge in the pipe that is reading a negative value, then the pipe pressure is below the environmental pressure we would say this pipe is under a vacuum. Let's now look at a centrifugal pump installed in a piping system. We have a compound gauge installed on the suction of the pump and a pressure gauge installed on the discharge of the pump. The amount of pressure the pump is adding to the system or boosting can be calculated by taking the discharge pressure and subtracting the suction pressure. In case one, the suction gauge reads 20 psi and the discharge gauge reads 70 psi. Therefore, the pump is boosting the system by 50 psi. In case two, the compound gauge on the suction reads minus 5 psi and the discharge gauge reads 50 psi. Therefore, the pump is boosting the system by 55 psi. 